Sometimes when you look at design of other people, you may think they're very complicated pieces, but in fact, they're really simple to create. And I'll show you how easy it is when you understand the tools. Okay, let's go. Look, modeling is important, I know, but so is everything else in the design process. In our free Hard Surface Jumpstart course, you will not only feel more comfortable with hard surface modeling, but also confident with rendering and excited about your new game-changing portfolio. Link is in your video description. Let's get started. So let's grab a cube here, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold V and grab a cavity here and S, Y and skeleton Y axis, okay? And we're going to grab this one and GX and make it a little bit thinner, okay? Somewhere here, something like that. What I want to do now is I want to cut it. So side view, orthographic, and shift V, make sure you're gonna click align to ortho with box cutter D, make sure you select box cut and draw it here, hold shift and click. And then we're gonna grab an end gun, right? And deselect cyclic, run it here. Press T if you don't see the solidification. So T and click, alt text and, you know, mare, okay? Let's go to local and we're going to apply this, okay? So let's just go here and multiply. We're going to remove this edge here. So let's just get rid of that, okay? So dissolve edges now. And let's see if we have any junk. We do, so press three with machine tools to clean it. You need to enable cleanup with machine tools. Alt, control, click here, shift, alt, control, click, and shift, alt, control, click, right? And then control B to bevel. Okay, go back, shift to, perfect. Now comes the tricky bit, okay? So uh, with hard ops, what we're gonna do is we're gonna select um, the edge of, you know, this solidified piece here and press control Q. Now, if this doesn't work for you, it means that you don't have a shortcut assigned. So what you need to do is press Q, go to mesh tools, align view and simply click it or assign shortcut right click and assign shortcut okay mine is control q so control q then i can hold alt and scroll it right here hold control and scroll it like this to you know 45 degrees okay then i'm going to press alt x with hard ops press x to reset my mirror press tab to enable more options go to view okay and then hold shift and you can mirror it like that okay how cool is this boom you're done then let's change a view and i think we pg so click on that operations multiply and then uh go to clean mesh okay also what we can do is run a, a knife cut here so let's just go here to um to box cut and run it like this and press k right and one more here and just slice now what we're gonna do is we're gonna remove all that stuff that's junk okay like these we don't really need these they're gonna be uh, really bad for running bevels okay so let's just remove all them okay so dissolve edges and the same here you don't really need that this is bad uh, any of these crazy edges here in corners they need to go okay because they're gonna be ruining our bevel flow so let's just get rid of them this one also is not ideal remove all these just leave perpendicular edges okay and the rest can go okay cool so now we clean right almost so these and on the bottom so what we're going to do now is we're going to um we're going to run the bevel on this okay bevel plus one and then alt click on sharpen to introduce weight normals let's select this edge here okay and this edge here and this and this okay and then what we're going to do is we're going to control b that okay so we introduce a bevel here and then Go to operations and clean mesh right we're almost there guys so now let's grab this one okay and shift curve extract right shift test to geometry with machine tools right or we need to solidify it first so sharpen for one more time shift test to geometry pg let's select this loop inside and delete verts click here okay on this one press f and alt x to the other side with mesh machine then just scale it a little bit like this okay right and we can actually insert it so insert it here and we're gonna get some problem right you seen this so we can fix this no problem so grab this edge control click here y and unfuck with mesh machine then alt x and alt x okay grab this one right you can actually mirror them here so we got that let's just select this one press f and then let's extrude it up here okay 
and we're getting somewhere slowly right so now we, we need to just kind of like an opening here on this side okay so simply you know extrude it right and you're good to go uh, we could have uh, two cuts in here like this okay all text and mirror and sharpen and weighted normals so here click on this shift click on that alt x x to reset the mirror press a to add another mirror and then mirror across okay and there you go there's your beam in five minutes okay so you know you don't have to over complicate things you just have to learn the tools all right so if you want to learn more about you know hard ups and box cutter uh, you can grab our course ultimate guide to hard ups and box cutter you can also grab our free terminal course which is linked in the video description which will teach you a lot about hard ups and box cutter okay well there you go guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one